Well, let me show you the uh, Saka, Saka penalty shout again, because I know that you two think this was absolutely a penalty. Mm. I'll represent the other side. Ali McCoy was saying, look, actually, if you watch his right leg, it kind of delays this a little bit, his right leg. And then does he lean into it? Does he lift his leg into it? Uh, However... I get what you're saying. I, yeah, I can what, see that side of the argument. But this, this one's the one bit. here. Neuer's leg, he delays his leg from planting it and leaves it out. That split second, which means for me it has to be a penalty. He's deliberately doing that. It's movement towards the ball. And I think if you had 10 top European referees here tonight, nine of them would have given it. And this referee is the only one who hasn't given it. I, I find it quite alarming that he hasn't given that penalty. But look, Neuer, you see that movement towards the ball there, Laura? That is enough to give that penalty for me. What's slightly unclear about this situation is it looks like the referee um, checks his ears, points to his ears and says no penalty, which, which we assume means we've spoken to VAR, no penalty. In commentary, you are informed of, of those decisions and whether or not VAR are having a look. And there wasn't a message that came through to say they are having a look. So it's kind of unclear whether or not VAR did get involved in that or not. Um, it could have a huge effect I, on this I, I, story, I don't think that was clear. I thought they had to send him to look at it. His actual position when he's there watching it, he's crouched down, he's looking direct at it. Mm. And then they don't even send him to go and have a look at it. Down. He's going at high speed there. Mm. Send, him to, send him and have a look at it. He has to go and have a look at that. As a ref, he surely wants to go and have a look at himself anyway.